Thank you for joining this quick how-to screencast brought to you by Salesforce Support. To see more content like this, hit subscribe. In this video, we're going to learn how to rename exported attachments or document files on a Mac. When you select Include Images, Documents, and Attachments in your data export, you will notice that all the attachments are exported into an Attachments subfolder and that they are named according to their associated 18-digit Salesforce ID and not the file name or extension. In order to identify the name and file type, you need to consult the attachment.csv file, also included in the data export. It is possible to rename the files back to the original file name using a batch file. In this screencast, I'll be using a Mac. The following instructions are for Mac only. For information on the process for Windows, review the link on the bottom of the screen. We've also put this link in the short description of this video for you. First, log into the org. Click the gear icon, select Setup, and type Export in the Quick Find box. Click Data Export, click Export Now, and select Initiate a data export that includes images, documents, attachments, and various objects. Click Start Export. Once the export is done, go back to the Data Export page and download the zip file onto your Mac Downloads folder. Double-click the zip folder and it will extract into another folder. Open this unzipped folder and open the Documents folder. Notice the files are named by IDs. Go back to the unzipped folder and open the file documents.csv in Excel. Delete all columns but ID and name. Once all the other columns are deleted, ID should be in column A and name should be in column B. Copy the formula shown here on the screen and paste it into cell C2. The resulting cell should look like this. Double-click the lower right corner of cell C2 to copy all the way down to the last row filled in in column C. Select column C and copy it. Open TextEdit on Mac and paste the contents. Save it as plain text by pressing Command plus Shift plus T. Save the file. Name it as rename.sh and place it in the unzipped document export folder. Open the terminal in Mac, type CD, followed by a space, and then drag the Documents folder from the unzipped folder, which contains the rename.sh file, into the terminal and add PWD. Press Enter. Type sudo chmod777 rename.sh and then press Enter. Enter your password onto the next line and click Enter. Type sudo dot forward slash rename dot sh and then press Enter. It should run quickly. Go to the Documents folder in the Unzipped folder and note that the files are named properly. Please keep in mind that in order to follow the steps of exporting data, you'll need system administrator permissions. If you're interested in obtaining data exports and do not have those permissions, please contact your system administrator for assistance. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or join us on the trail at trailblazer.salesforce.com.